I'm glad God is racist. Right. Because when I read this Bible and I figure out that I'm an Israelite and that God looks at me and that God said he loved me and I can look at my people around, they're on drugs and they're high and they want to get abortions. Those are the people who Christ loves. Right. Those are people who Christ died for. Romans 9, 13. As my auto I was breaking out, says, Jacob I have loved, but Esau have I hated. I love reading that verse because that's the stuff that gives us hope. And we believe in this Bible every single day and we, we read every single day. Because even, let me, let me tell you a quick story. At my slavery, which is my job, there is a lady that worked there for three years. She wanted to get promoted. So she's busting her butt every single day, working night shift, not seeing her children, taking pay cuts. She, she even graduated from, 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 from college with, with a degree, but she wanted to move up. And you know what the oppressor did? They brought a new lady on there, which is an Edomite, which is Esau, which is the colonizers. And in three months, they promoted her to get the new position. That's so much disrespect that all the work that you just put in, it means for nothing. And then on top of that, they fired her. But the most High is going to get revenge. Right. Romans chapter 9 and verse 10. As it is written, Jacob have I love. Jacob have I love. Jacob is every person on this sign. If you don't see your nation on this sign, Most High does not love you. But Esau have I hated. But Esau have I hated. Esau is the pilgrims. They came over here in their, in their ships, you know what I mean? Right. And their makeup and those funny hats. And they started the 13 colonies after they killed us. After they killed the uh, native Indians. He says he hates them. Read it again for me. Romans chapter 9 and verse 13. As it is written, Jacob have I loved, but Esau have I hated. Esau have I hated. And we know God is racist. God is racist. He hates every other nation but Israelites. And, and you know what racism includes? Slavery. Now we was in slavery to the so-called pilgrim. But the Most High has another form of slavery. Isaiah 14. This is our salvation. When we put the other nations in slave in, in chains, when, when we put the other nations in, inside captivity, that's real slavery. Well, I was just thinking like, oh. We're to show you in the Bible that your pastor never brought out. He never brought this out. Isaiah 14 and 2. Isaiah chapter 14. Isaiah chapter 14 and verse 1. For the Lord will have mercy on Jacob and will yet choose Israel. And will yet choose Israel. I didn't write the Bible. I just I just started reading it. I'm a young man in this. Go ahead. And set them in their own land. And set them in their own land. Blacks, Hispanics, and Native Indians, we don't have our own land. We don't know where to go. If we leave America, what nation are we gonna go to? Africans don't rock with us. The Chinese don't rock with us. What nation do we have we gonna call our own? But the Most High is gonna give us a nation. I mean, the, the Most High is gonna set us in our own land. And the strangers shall be joined with them. And the strangers shall be joined with them. I know a lot of you Christians like to include everybody. I'm gonna show you what they're included. Because I want, listen, I want nations, I want the other nations in our kingdom. Go ahead. And they shall cleave to the house of Jacob. And they shall cleave to the house of, of Jacob. Go ahead. Verse two, and the people shall take them. And the people shall what? And the people shall take them. And the people shall take them. I got it. And bring them to their place. And the house of Israel shall, shall possess them in the land. And the people of Israel shall possess them. Not only are we going to take them, if you forcibly take some, you are claiming it as your own. That's mine. That's our terror. We're taking that. Go ahead. And the house of Israel shall possess them in the land of the Lord. In the land of the Lord. For servants and handmaids. For what? For servants and handmaids. For servants and handmaids. 
That sounds pretty racist to me. Right. That sounds racist to me. Trying to find something to follow Had loyalty, every man tried to borrow Felt pain and a lot of sorrow Got betrayed so packed, I didn't even have my heart broke Living confused, about to lose hope Cops got me on the side of the road Like a sideshow, need an antidote before I croak Now I'm setting fire to rhythm man blues Call this guitar smoke Rebel with no cause, trying to find direction The world got me vexed Picked up a bad lick of habit that's hereditary from oppression Felt like my life was on fire trying to find an exit Now look, 10 G's plus a good wreck Sometimes a follower is a soldier Trying to find a good ship Plus when you in hell, how do you excel? Wisdom the breath of life, I don't believe in fairy tale Listen well to what I tell No call it can cause pain Something that a rebel knows very well Can't you tell I was sent from the Lord Got a tongue like a two-edged sword